everybody. It's me, Benjamin Crudwig, and this is not a podcast. This is um, not a podcast um, because this is actually a review. I decided that instead of doing a review in my general podcast, that I would do a review um, separately. So that way that it's a little bit easier for people to find and see what I'm talking about. Um, if you stick around for the end of the review, I do have an awesome um, opportunity for my viewers. Um, it is a coupon code, so that's really awesome. But I thought I would do some of an unboxing as well as a review. So these are my initial reactions and um, ge genuine thoughts. So I was... Um, able to participate in a review for Love and Leche, which is a company based out of New Mexico that makes lotion bars and soap. Their soaps have natural goat's milk in them, and their lotion bars are made with all natural ingredients. I have always wanted to try Love and Leche, um, so it was just really awesome that I was able to jump onto this review train and let you all know what I think. So came in a little box like this um, <laughs> cute so on the outside there's a little sheep on the card or I guess a goat would make sense it's not a sheep jeez jeez Benjamin know your fiber animals um, so this goat her name is Sula um, and it says her creamy milk goes into our soothing nanny goat milk soap um, so that's where this comes from. So the reason that they've asked for a review is because they have been making lotion bars and have been making, um, soap for a really long time. However, knitters are, you know, you know that in the winter or in general when you knit, your hands get really dry. And with the lotion bars, they're solid... They're solid bars of lotion that make it really easy and not goopy to make your hands more moist as you work. So she, um, the the owner, um, was asked many many times to create a lotion bar for knitters. So they got a new mold created by a local artisan down in New Mexico, and that is a new product launch. So I'm going to pull this out. So first of all. The lotion bars come in these tins, um, so you see it's Love and Leche lotion bar. I love these tins so much. They're really, really cute. And this flavor, flavor, don't eat this, <laughs> um, this scent is lemongrass. And um, I decided that I wanted to test out a scent that I thought would be more masculine, but I didn't want unscented. Let me read you the back, just that you... Enjoy the sensual pleasure of rubbing our lotion bar to soothe rough hands and feet, chapped lips, painful split fingers, and more. As you massage the bar between your hands, your body temperature will melt and soften the oils and beeswax, allowing your skin to be replenished and deeply moisturized. The ingredients in these are all natural, so we have pure beeswax, coconut oil, almond oil, um, infused with calendula flowers, and some essential oils. It's all made in New Mexico, as I said, and... Let's get started, shall we? Oh, yum. So they got a new mold. And it is cute little sheep love. Do you see that? Isn't it cute? It's two little sheep. So the great thing about the tin is that you can just pop it out of the tin. A little bit of it got stuck in the bottom because it's been actually quite warm in Colorado recently. I I already love this. Oh, that feels really nice. So you just, um, I guess I should show you. You just take the bar and you can rub it on the areas that are most dry. So like for me, it's like the backs of my hands actually get quite dry in the winter. Actually, just all the time in Colorado. The lemongrass scent is really light which is wonderful. It's not a really heavy scent. I'm very, very picky about the scents that I allow into my home slash on my body. Yeah, it smells just like a really, really lovely, lovely lemon 
flavor, scent. You know how lemongrass kind of has a sharp tone to it? This almost has that. It's not as sharp as you would think, but it's not so citrusy like a, a real lemon. Mmm. Mmm. I really like that. So again, it comes in a tin. I don't know how many ounces this is. Two and a half ounces. It's a two and a half ounce bar. So um, it's a nice heavy duty bit of lotion. I don't know how long that'll last, so that'll be a fun little test. What I like about the lemongrass is that it's subtle, but it, I don't know, I like having a little bit of that scent just kind of pop up every now and again. Um, and it's, it's actually, more of an androgynous smell or a unisex smell scent. Um, it's not very feminine, but it's not like super masculine. And then they also sent me a little sample. Um, this is the lavender scent. Mm, yum. So this is kind of their traditional sample scent. Uh, mold, not stamp, mold. And you see it's a little honeybee because it is made with real beeswax. Um, and even though, even though I already have lemongrass on my hands, I'm also going to try this one out. I love how this feels. It's, um, oh, and this is like, sorry, okay. <laughs> Woo! I am in sensory overload right now. So this lavender is, again, it's a very subtle scent, so it's not overpowering. And it smells like a real lavender plant. Oh man, this makes me miss summer so much. The feeling of it isn't greasy. Um, it is a little thick at first, you know, it is solid and it's beeswax. So having this, um, you can really feel how it coats your hand and makes it feel softer. And it's actually, it's soaking in pretty quickly. So it's, I think it's better than what you would find a lot of like paraben style lotions um, where they get kind of, they feel goopy and greasy. This doesn't feel greasy, it just feels a little waxy. Um, that it is soaking into my skin. And the more that you rub your hands, the warmer the oils and the wax gets, so the more it soaks in to the skin. Um, I am very, very pleased to to have these now. So these, I like how it feels on my hands. Um, they have a multitude of scents available. They do have um, a lotion bar for men uh, that I think I'll probably actually order. Um, you know, I have a second lotion bar if I want, and it's a cedarwood smell. They're not making it with this new mold, the little sheep love mold. Um, it's just like a, it looks like a ram's horn. So it's, you know, a masculine scent for, a masculine mold for masculine scent. So yeah, um, I would like to try that one. And then they have like a variety of lavender scents and lemongrass scents. So I would definitely head over and check out which scents there are. Um, speaking of which, I have been given a coupon code for my viewers and for my fans. So if you use the code Benjamin K, and that's Benjamin all lowercase and then K, capital K in the checkout, um, if you buy a $14 tin, so one of these, you'll get a free sample um, of any, any variety. So the tin is valued at $14, and then the sample is actually valued at $4. It's more like a travel size. I don't, like, I would not call this a sample. This is larger than a sample. Um, this will last quite some time. I'll probably give this to my wife. So yeah, um, until May 1st, 2017, um, you can get a free sample size um, valued at $4 if you buy a $14 tin. So um, thank you to the crew at Love & Leche for letting me do this review. And I am... I am really thrilled, and that's my honest opinion. So yeah, please head over to Love and & Leche and get yourself a tin with the Sheep Love tin, um, the Sheep Love mold, and get yourself a free sample as well.
So thank you for watching this review. If you liked this video, um, please subscribe, um, give it a thumbs up, that really helps. And keep an eye out for more reviews coming very shortly in the future. Bye.